Hi guys! I went to the pumpkin patch, so in this Crafty Friday video, I am going to be decorating pumpkins. Last year I showed you a crayon melting pumpkin idea, so be sure to check that video out if you haven't already. But stay tuned for new decorating ideas right now. Snap, snap, let's get to it. I'm going to start with these adorable little pumpkins. For the first one, I gathered some rhinestones and now I am gluing those on with E6000 glue. As you can see, I'm attaching these to each section of the pumpkin to create a really pretty pattern. Similarly, I'm drawing a heart pattern on this pumpkin with some Sharpie markers. I really like the black, gold, and silver color scheme, if you couldn't tell. Next, these even tinier pumpkins are getting a puffy paint makeover. This one is dressing up as a little cupcake. I'm even giving it some glass seed bead sprinkles. How cute! For the one on the left, I put rings of zigzag lines that radiate out from the stem, and the one on the right just has tons of circles that share outlines. If you want to get this effect, just start from the center and work your way out. Here's another simple, no carb design. Find a pumpkin with a stem that makes a good nose. Then use permanent markers or paint to apply some eyes and a mouth. Top off this look with a hat and call it a day. Actually don't because there's more pumpkins and more to do. I got this sparkly witch hat headband from Michaels. Just go ahead and remove the band and then hot glue the hat part to the pumpkin. Time for yet another pumpkin with a face. Find some fake vampire teeth, I got mine from a party store, carve out a hole, place those teeth inside, and then draw on some eyes. For this next design, we're gonna have to deal with pumpkin guts. I know, it's gross, but it's fun. I purchased these pumpkin carving tools from Walmart for a fairly inexpensive price, as you can see. Once the top is off your pumpkin and all the seeds are out, we add the secret ingredient. Light bright pegs, oh yeah. Use a plastic pokey tool to start the hole, then to make sure that the light will shine all the way through, use a long thin tool. Now your colorful peg has a slot to hang out in. Repeat these steps as many times as needed to finish your light bright pumpkin. I got Craig to carve a pumpkin with me because he went to the pumpkin patch. So what are you making? Or is it a surprise? <clears throat> no, I'll, I'll, I'll share it. It's going to be Frankenstein. Cool. So as you guys know, I'm doing light brights. And my face is really dark. Ah. <laughs> What's going on here? Just Ooh, got look. done. Got all his points marked out. I'm going to start cutting them out now. Yay. Here is the light bright pumpkin that I made and the Frankenstein pumpkin that my boyfriend carved. In the nighttime footage you saw us working on these so tonight when it's dark again I'm actually going to show you what these look like with the candle burning. Here's my before and after. Yay! So enthusiastic. <laughs> they are looking too fabulous. Alright guys, you know the drill. If you decorate a pumpkin that is inspired by this video, take a picture and use hashtag SoCraftastic on Instagram. You might just see your creation in next week's Crafty Friday video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and got some ideas on how to decorate your pumpkins for the Halloween and just fall season in general. Please subscribe to So Craftastic if you haven't already because I put out new crafty videos every single Friday for Crafty Friday and I also put out sometimes crafty videos throughout the week so you'll just have to stay tuned and subscriptions let you know exactly when I post a video so that is a good thing to do if you haven't already. Anyway, let's check out the pictures from last week crafty Friday video I actually did an edible treat and it was how to decorate your cupcakes to look like cute little owls so here's pictures that were sent to me on Instagram hashtag so craftastic and also Twitter and Facebook 
I really like all the owls that you guys made. They're so cute and they look so yummy. Thank you guys so much for sending those pictures in to me. I hope you guys have a great rest of the day and I will see you soon. Bye. <laughs> Just pick a pumpkin. Okay, which one looks good? Let me spot Kent. Rejected. These are my three baby pumpkins, so they're getting juggled right now. Yay! I still got it. Alright, the end. Bye!